Are you looking for the newest in electric vehicles? If so, this is the list for you. New and innovative with faster speeds and more extended range, these are some of the best around. I'm Glenn, and today we are bringing you 10 of the best electric vehicles we could find. Number 10. Defiant EV3 Roadster, designed from the ground up, capitalizes on the capabilities of an electric car with an eye on a sporty design. These plug-in electric roadsters are a blend of the best of today's propulsion technology and smooth aerodynamic styling. Comfortably designed to carry a driver and two passengers, the full-sized electric commuter has plenty of room for cargo. Depending on the battery option selected, the single charge commuting range of the Roadster is up to 175 miles, has a top speed of 70 miles per hour, and can accelerate from zero to 60 miles per hour in around 10 seconds. Number nine. This mini electric vehicle, the 2020 Mini Cooper SE, is fully loaded with premium features like active driving assistant, Apple CarPlay, and if you can find a 50 kilowatt DC fast charger, you're looking at an 80% charge in just 36 minutes. With a 181 horsepower drivetrain, this Mini will do zero to 60 miles per hour in 6.9 seconds and has a range of 110 miles. And then of course, there's the new car's wealth of modern convenience and safety features, its more robust feeling cabin, and so on. Number eight. Sondors, a company that got its start in the e-bike world, is developing a car that was inspired by the Gran Turismo video game series. The car itself has two front seats and one back seat, three wheels, and an expected range of 200 miles. The vehicle is said to go from zero to 60 miles an hour in around five seconds. You can charge the vehicle with either a 110 volt or 240 volt outlet. As of now, Sondors is just into the start of the production phase of their plan. Number seven. Meticulously sculpted to maximize interior space below an extensive glass canopy, the Air delivers a full-size interior within a mid-size exterior. Lucid Air's standard rear seating provides superb comfort for up to three adults with lots of legroom. Being able to hit top speeds while hugging tight corners, the low center of gravity delivers precision handling and a quiet ride. The Lucid has 1,800 horsepower with a top speed of over 200 miles per hour. Lucid's highly efficient power electronics and world-class battery technology enable an estimated 400 miles or more of range. Number six. Volvo XC40 Recharge, assembled in Ghent, Belgium, can now be ordered ahead of its arrival later this year in select markets. The all-wheel drive Recharge gets 402 horsepower and can accelerate to 60 miles an hour in just 4.7 seconds. It has a 78 kilowatt hour battery pack, producing up to 248 miles of range and can fast charge from 10 to 80% in roughly 40 minutes. With the Volvo OnCall app, you can cool or heat your vehicle with the remote start, lock or unlock the car, check the charging status, and much more. The vehicle will also include Google Assistant, Google Play Store, and Google Maps, so you are always connected even without your smartphone. I'm Ali, and it's Mind's Eye Trivia Time. By looking at just these images, do you know what this is and where it's from? Leave the correct answer or your best guess in the comment section below. Number five. The BYD E1 is an all-new, all-electric car introduced in China. The BYD E1 can charge from 30 to 80% in one and a half hours. 
and has a large 32.2 kilowatt hour battery that gets up to 190 miles on a single charge. On the inside of the vehicle, you will find a floating display on the center console and a three spoke steering wheel. Number four. The 2020 BMW i3 electric vehicles get 153 miles of all electric driving range with its 42.2 kilowatt hour battery pack. Its unusual exterior is balanced by an upscale, albeit unique interior that has ample room up front, but less than adequate space in the back. Rear hinge doors and the lack of a B pillar present the side of the i3 for easier access and an expansive feel. All i3 models come with BMW's iDrive 6 infotainment interface. Number three. When the all-electric Vanderhall Edison 2 three-wheeler hits dealer lots in the third quarter of 2020, it will be the company's third model line. The Edison 2 gets from zero to 60 miles per hour in four seconds with a top speed of 105 miles per hour. Meanwhile, the 30 kilowatt hour lithium ion battery pack allows 200 miles of range per charge. Inside Edison 2, you'll find heated seats, a 600 watt Bluetooth enabled sound system, and plenty of cargo space. Number two. Fiat's Cento Venti will go into production as an electric replacement for the aging Fiat Panda. You can build and personalize the Cento Venti using a range of pieces. There are some attractive vinyl wraps for the body, a few paint options for the alloy wheels, various bumper trims, and even a variety of roof styles. Fiat plans to offer expandable modular batteries that can be added or removed depending on how far you need to drive. Although Fiat hasn't stated when the concept will go on sale, you can expect to see it within the next several years. I'm Allie and it's Mind's Eye Trivia Time. By looking at just these images, do you know what this is and where it's from? Leave the correct answer or your best guess in the comment section below. Number 1 The 2021 Rivian R1S is a seven-passenger sport utility vehicle. It will be the second one produced by the Michigan-based electric vehicle manufacturer. This SUV shares many characteristics with the R1T pickup, including three battery sizes. The top 754 horsepower model will go from 0 to 60 in 3 seconds. Each version of the R1S has an electric motor at each wheel, providing all-wheel drive and remarkable off-road ability. The R1S claims a beautifully designed cabin with modern styling, wood trim, elegant leather, and two displays, one for the driver's gauge display and one for infotainment, a spacious front trunk, a massive rear cargo area and a spacious looking third row add to the utility of the vehicle. The R1S will be marketed direct to consumers starting in early 2021.